Well, I'm ready for the gig. Now all I gotta do is put my tent in here and I'm leaving. Stand by. We'll see how it goes this afternoon. Sunshine is out, rain is uh we don't know what the rain is. Stand by for more. It looks beautiful right there, don't it? But look right there. <laughs> What am I going to get into? Good googa booga. I turned around. <laughs> Just in the nick of time, it looks like. Summer. Well, that was a little gully washer. I'm going to try it again. I unloaded my truck and picked the CTX up and went to the bay for an hour before the second storm got me. One big fat bullet, only one casing, and I think I only found three or four that fell through, so there weren't too many of them around today. A really old charm bracelet. Maybe a gold bracelet in its day. I can't find any marks on it. A little silver ring. And a nice old 10K. I like it. Do little icebergs. Stand by, somebody's calling me. God called me a few minutes ago, said that he couldn't get to the market. I said, I couldn't either. He said, I got some knives I'm going to bring them to you. I said, okay. He had a set of 12. He's a chef at Westminster Canterbury, not far from here. But he wanted me to just sharpen these four. You can see they got some major scratches in them. So what happened to them? Look at that one. Anyway, I'll get them sharpened up for him tomorrow. He wants them back around 10 or 11 o'clock. Then me and the ring man are going to look for a platinum ring. Lady lost her platinum ring. The problem is, she thinks she lost it in her house. I'll give you more on that later. What do you want, cat man do? Hmm? Come here. You're a big old kitty cat. Yes, you are a big old kitty cat. No, I'm a nice kitty cat now, Daddy. Yes, I am. I'm a nice kitty cat. I'm almost a lap cat. Like hell. <laughs> yeah. That's a little scooter. You hungry? You're always hungry. I forgot the guy with the uh, chef's knives. He gave me this old pocket knife. He said it was his daddy's. He wants me to sharpen that up for him. Got some scratches too. It's got a whale on it. Says Solidrin. I'll give you some better pictures of it. It's a nice old taquita.
Well, it's Friday morning about 10.30, 10.20. I got the knives done, I'm getting ready to take them back. I gotta pick up the ring man, and then we're going to hunt for some platinum at this lady's house. And then we're headed back to the bay. Stand by. Well, there's a lot more breeze than what I wanted to see today. I can tell you that. There's lots of depositors. Breeze, too much breeze. That's the second target, 1935 Buffalo. I dug a big piece of aluminum in that, so far. Got everything but the fixture itself. Guy today, find all the connections. I can't quite make out the date. Stand by. Got a rough gate. Looks like a fit all ring now. These are the chiquitos. Back with not much treasure today. On a slow day. Well, we're getting ready for the roundup for Friday. After we dropped off the uh, chef's knives at Westminster Canterbury, we picked up some pampered chef's knives to do at the fair tomorrow if it don't get rained out. It's raining like brick bats right now. It's uh, 8 p.m. or so. Gathering a pamper chef knife in one pocket knife. There's a uh, the junk. There's the best of it. A weedy, 53 weedy, a 35 buffalo with a fit all. We'll get the we'll get it put together in a minute. It was uh, rough as bricks and not many targets. Me, low tie Tim, and the ring man. Two egg stickers in the same scoop. You saw that. You saw the, I'm not sure you saw the bullet. You saw one of these. I guess no 22s today, but plus some big shells, casings. 53 weedy, 35 buffalo. To my fit all. It's a nice little fit all. You want to find fit all, you want to find nice ones like that. If there is such a thing, there's a nice fit all. Got the nice gig tomorrow if it don't rain, get rained out. If it gets rained out, I'll see you for a spin somewhere. Stand by. Good luck to everybody. <laughs>